Hello Ethan, how are you? It's been a while since I did a video installment in the series, but Christmas is coming. The candle is lit. The Palo Santo, the sacred uh, wood purifying wood, which we burn as incense, is lit. It makes the most beautiful fragrant smell. I will light some with you one day. And I miss you a lot. Every day I think about you deeply. And I am sending you for Christmas time the exclusive five book compendium hardback of the Monster Multiverse. I have a letter for you, four pages, which I'm going to read to you now. This is just in case, for whatever reason, the post goes missing or whatever happens. Uh, you don't get it. You know I've written to you and you know the contents and this is documented all for you. So, um, the date is the 7th of December and I'm sending your package out later today with your book. So, look out for it. The letter says, Dearest Ethan, it is almost that time of the year again when we celebrate the love of family and the joys of love and the beautiful moments we share with our loved ones. For it is in these moments that we truly can savour what it means to be alive and also to spend time to consider how others are not so fortunate as ourselves, having food and shelter. Every day I think of you and every day I wish I could talk to you and cuddle you, but I know in my heart that today will come in the not so distant future. It has been an extremely difficult time for me to bear this separation from you, but when I sit still in awareness with an open heart filled with love, I feel there isn't separation at all. You are with me and I am with you, if not in physical form, in a space that transcends what is material. So what I'm saying there is, there is something greater and bigger that connects all of us and all things and all of life beyond this temporary physical form that we both have, which is always changing, always, always in a state of change, you know. You imagine you go to bed at night, you're breathing, you're breathing, the oxygen, the chemical reactions happen within the body, you wake up a new person. Every moment you feel different, mentally, sometimes you're excited, sometimes you're sad, sometimes you're this, sometimes you're that. And sometimes you feel wonderful in the body, full of energy. Other times you're sick and coughing and sneezing. So life is just change. But the point I'm making here is um, when I sit still in awareness with an open heart filled with love, I feel there's no separation at all. You are with me and I am with you, if not in physical form, in a space that transcends what is material. Because souls that connect through the strongest of bonds like us, a father and a son connection, are inseparable and connected for the eternity of time. That is the deepest of truth and it is the very law of nature itself, as with my very limited understanding of life, as I understand it. So that was page one. Moving on to page two. This new page brings me to share an exciting and beautiful development of life with you. In one month, a new life will enter this world, your sister. Yes, you will be a big brother to a beautiful baby girl, and I cannot wait for you to meet her and connect with her. There has been a lot of change in life recently. I moved to the North Sea coast of Germany to a town called Wilhelmshaven, where one is from, that's where I am now. It is a nice enough place to live for this short period of my life. We are living here in a house left to us by Swanee's great auntie, who departed from this world last year. I've been going deeper into the nature of my being with my ever-inspiring practice of meditation. I feel such happiness and inspiration from this daily activity. It has changed my life in such profound ways. I hope you're also very happy, enjoying school and your life as it is, down there by the sea. In this parcel, Please find a more or less finished version of our wonderful creation. This is truly a dedication to you and an expression of love and commitment I have for you as your father. Page three. 
Monster Multiverse is now a series of five paperback books which I'll finish 100% and publish next year. What I'm sending you in this parcel is an exclusive one-of-a-kind compendium hardback edition. This I gift to you, dear son, is my first print working copy of all five books and all their content. This is before they're separated out into the paperback versions, the Book of Fire, the Book of Ether, the Book of Earth, the Book of Water and the Book of Air. Please forgive my error within the included copy of Monster Multiverse as there are you see this pink thing? There are two missing pages, which I made an error on, but you can imagine what the content is in this story, in the last quest for the leg of air. Um, well, it's time for me to go now. I'm going to create a huge abstract piece of art on a mirror. Always being creative and expressing myself, so I like to do. I hope and pray every day so much that I can soon connect with you again, show you how much I love you, how much you mean to me. That will never change. My love for you as your father is eternal and undying. My pledge to you is to always do my best and be there for you and that I am however I can be now and always. So I'm sending all my love and my best wishes for the most incredible Christmas time. I dream of the day that I'm once again able to be in contact with you, to see you, to cuddle you, your father in love and in life. With, of course, a little drawing for you. It says, into the depths. With some kind of peculiar monsters in the sky. No surprise there. So, here we are. Well, I'm going to um, the very latest January pick up this series for you again because I've got a lot more instalments, a lot more to share with you, a lot more to tell you. Um, but yeah, so so that's where I am now. I just wanted to make this short video for you right now, showing you what I'm sending you, showing you Monster Multiverse, and showing you the letter, and having that on record within this series. So for now, I love you and I will leave you. But I'm never really leaving you. All my love. Your father. <laughs>